Okay, hello world, this is Dennis. Been a while since I've uh, made a video, and uh, as you can tell here by the layout on my desktop, I am now on Linux. I basically got sick of uh, <laughs> got sick of Windows. I uh, can't update this computer to Windows 11, so I thought, okay, the heck with it, we're switching over to Linux. And um, it was not an easy transition, but I was uh, able to get everything up and running. And, um, one of the things I kind of wanted to show you here was um, some of the SDR software I have on the computer here, and we're going to bring up uh, GQRX. Um, there we go. It's a nice program. Um, Bidly, in my opinion, it's not quite as nice as like uh, SDR Sharp or like SDR Uno, but uh, it still does a pretty good job, and I've been enjoying it and uh, let's see here let's um, fire up the program here one of the things that kind of irritates me is how I have to keep you know switching back and forth between these different tabs to get to uh, different features but yeah, it's just uh, a uh, um, some minor nitpicking it's not uh, a deal breaker but uh, well, let's uh, start this up and take a look here Okay, so we got uh, WWV on the screen, and uh, let's see here, let's uh, zoom in, and let's uh, bring up the coloring here a little bit, there we go, oh, it looks like we got Trenton Military over here, so switch to upper sideband, gonna go over here, there we go. Got a nice signal here. I'm using my NFED random wire antenna, which is um, over 250 feet of wire. Got a nice uh, strong signal there. Now, uh, one of the things that kind of throws me off is, um, here, let me uh, mute this for a moment. I'm used to, uh, with uh, SDR programs where when you, you can uh, set your uh, your tune step, so you can set it for like 1 kilohertz, 5 kilohertz, blah, 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 blah. Um, so far from playing around with this, it does not seem to have that option, but I have found out if I want to, you know, move around faster, just grab this and go, woo, back and forth, and, you know, obviously this is up close so if I want to get around the band a little bit faster this is better for you know like um, AM signals and I can grab this and go boop a doop a doop what is this over here oh is this I think that's Cuba I wonder what oh that's probably one of those interference or something I'm not sure but uh, anyhow let's go back over here But yeah, overall, uh, GQRX is uh, it's a pretty good program. Let's uh, stop this here. And uh, glad to have SDR++, because uh, this is a lot like um, SDR Sharp. So I'm glad that this is available for Linux. And uh, let's go up to WWV here. Now this I like because everything I need is just laid out right here on this side panel. I don't have to go through, uh, you know, different tabs. There we go. Just this here a little bit. There we go. So there we go. Got good old WWV. And uh, switch over to Trenton here. Oops. The one thing with um, with SDR++ here, I haven't quite figured out how to fix is, uh, I don't know if it was, if the program here is picking it up or not, but when there's a strong signal, there's a, a pop in the audio, so I haven't quite uh, figured that one out. But other than that, it works just as well as it did on, uh, on Windows. Uh-oh, are we back to no, no report received? Oh no, the no report received has uh, returned. 
Okay, and then finally for SDRs, I got SDR Connect here. Uh, this is for um, the SDR Play, and this is still, you know, this isn't. This is still in kind of like um, like a beta, so it's still not, you know, it's not the full program. So some of the gripes I have with this um, program, you know, it doesn't really matter because eventually it's going to get um, taken care of. So let's. Uh, Start this here. There we go, and then yeah, one of my nit pickles with uh, with SDR Connect is if I'm switching between the different modes, I constantly have to adjust the tuning step. But like I said, this is still in the beta, so that's eventually going to get taken care of. So. I'm not going to complain too much about that. And let's put this one back on real quick. Repeating aviation weather. Boop. Repeating aviation weather. Comarks. Comarks. There we go. No but yeah, overall, um, besides some of the little things that are bugging me about it, SDR Connect on uh, Linux is uh, running, uh, running pretty good. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show you my SDR setup here, and um, as you can tell, I got other stuff running. I got uh, WSJTX, I got my logbook here, got TQSL, um, even got this for SSTV. Although I can't figure out where it's sharing or saving the pictures because the folder is supposed to be in, nothing's showing up, so I still gotta <laughs> take care of that. But uh, anyhow, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, there'll be more coming uh, to do some more SDR recordings here on Linux Mint. Uh, like I said, I've been enjoying this, and um, hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, peace and all that good stuff, and 73.